G'day guys and welcome to the Chingy Lee Show. I'm Chingy Lee and this is episode 4 of my Minecraft series in uh, Chingy Craft. And uh, in this episode we are going to do some diamond mining. I'm here with uh, Engage Mars and Oz Skippy. They're already down in the mine somewhere. And uh, rather than go where they are, I'm going to dig a hole near my house. And uh, go down to the bedrock and I'll show you a technique for, uh, for trying to find diamonds. So we're just going to go straight down here. Don't forget to light up the way behind you. So you can find your way out every time. One of the first things you got to remember is never, uh, never dig straight down. It's Minecraft 101. I think everyone in the first game of Minecraft always digs straight down. And then they find lava and then they die. And then they go, oh, this game's shit. And then they don't play it for ages. So, uh, remember not to do that. Hey, Jace, have you got gold over here? Shit that you found. Good mine it. Oh, it's a diamond axe for gold? No. No, you just need iron for gold. Bam. Bam. Ooh. You need a diamond for what? Just obsidian? Yep. Uh, and then I think diamond just makes everything else faster. Come on. So, you can actually now look at your map. And, uh, oops, what am I doing? And it'll tell you what level you're on on your uh, Y axis. So I'm down on level 54 at the moment, and uh, we're actually looking to get down to uh, level 12. It's the best place to mine diamonds. So we're going to get down there. Another thing I like to do is whenever you see resources, no matter what they are, never leave them behind. Always go and get them. Because uh, you can always use iron, you can always use gold, definitely use coal. Just um, so we're just going to open this up a little bit now. Yeah. Make some stairs to get back up. Down to your right. You go this way over here, Skippy. Oh, a stupid point. move. Alright, <coughs> uh, let's roll. Hold up. Making lunch. Ooh, popcorn. Ooh. Oh no. Oh, you said it. I have popcorn right next to me. There's a new trick for you. Never dig up either. <laughs> you will die. I'm gonna go this way. You just, oh. it's dead. you just have no sense of adventure. Um, oh, I just fell um, into a new oh cave. Shit, into lava. I'm dead. I just fell into a new cups. unlit cave. <coughs> go on, let's go. One there. Uh, well, I'm bored and hungry, yeah. so. I'm going to leave to your recording. Yeah, see you later, Skip. And I'll go to play Battlefield or something. Alright. Yeah. We had some diamonds earlier, and then uh, 
Someone decided to go swimming in lava. He forgot to bring his enchanted armor. So he died. Okay, what have we got here? That's strange. This is cool. We have just found a mob spawner. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, no, nah. we got cocoa beans. I believe that is. Yep, cocoa beans. Other than that, nothing really good. But we will use this mob spawner uh, in the future. I'll show you a pretty good trick on. Uh, how to make a grinder. And we have diamonds. Yeah, yeah, boy. Yeah, boy. Hopefully we got more than one. We got two, three, four. We'll just open up this area all around it here. Just in case there's any more, because they can come diagonally. And if you look on the map, we are at level 13, so we are at a good level to find diamonds here. 12 to 15. That's the zone, that's where you want to be. And thankfully, according to our map, we are not far from our house, so we will, uh, we will take good advantage of this mob spawner. Definitely be getting this mossy cobblestone soon too. Because we love mossy cobblestone. You can't you can't make it. Let's see what's going here. I can't help but just explore everywhere. Rather than do what I'm supposed to be doing and finding diamonds. Hell yeah, I'm so glad to find this. Right, so let's continue with our stairs. Where where did they come from? Let's get this first. Pretty sure you can't make mossy cobblestone. I'll um, I'll have to look into that. I seen a couple of guys on uh, on Xbox. 360 edition that I've had whole floors of their houses made of the mo mossy cobblestone so they either, they either mined it from here and took it back up or, uh, or they made it somehow I'm pretty, I'm pretty certain you can't make it so anyway if you see cobblestone underground it's a dead giveaway that there's a mob spawner around because they uh only place a cobblestone is spawned Mossy by itself. Mm -hmm. No, no, the outside walls are always made of um, just regular cobblestone, and it's the floor that's made of mossy. Or actually, I think it can be a combination of both. Ooh, diamond. No, wait, gold. <laughs> Noob. Alright, we're at 14, so we will go down another level or two. Okay, let's go to here. We're at level 12. Now, the technique I like to use is to dig one straight line. Because basically what you want to do is, if you go in a straight line, you get to see this block here, this block here, and then the two side blocks, and then the two side blocks there. So you actually get to cover a fair bit in your view. So you dig like this for a while. How long you want to dig for. 
making sure you keep lighting it up so you don't have uh, don't have mob spawning. Even though currently we're playing in peaceful, uh, we don't want that happening when we go to hard in the future. We got some redstone. Redstone is on a low on the lower levels as well, so if you find plenty of redstone, you're definitely in diamond territory. so long I won't bother with that one just yet alright so then when you done your 2x2 two two tunnel you actually dig yourself this way too and you make another tunnel and you go again man that actually looks like diamonds when it's not lit up wish it was because again you get to see the, these two these two top and the bottom without whereas over here you, you've already seen these two so now you get to see these two and it means if you're just doing lines like this you get to see a lot more than if you just dig one big fat tunnel out Let's see. I always found too when you find dirt if you dig it out there's often diamonds behind the dirt so I like to dig out the dirt Looks like we've got more dirt in here. Can you tell me how far away I am from the house and which direction but on your map? Yep, yeah, uh, you're about 3,000 blocks away and keep going that way. Alright. Really disappointed if we set out on a diamond hunt and we find four diamonds. I will take this iron though. I don't like going past any resources. Is that a cave? It is not. Looked very dark. Uh, so I'm pretty well convinced there's nothing in here. So let's keep going with the strip mining. The other good thing about the strip mining is you may not uh, you may not necessarily find diamonds straight away, but you do get a lot of cobblestone. Ooh, and lapis. These people like me who likes to use different colours in their house for decoration. Lapis is not an easy one to find. It's actually as rare to find as diamonds, so I don't know. I'd rather have diamonds. Come on, come on. Bam, bam. Right, let's go back and get all this gold. We will be using this gold later for uh, a mine cart track, I'm sure. My phone makes for good recording. That does. All right, guys, that's it for another episode of the Chingy Lee Show. Uh, I've actually run over my 15 minutes, so hopefully I can cut this down. I'll uh, catch you guys next time.